so the sun is like hitting a side of me directly but if i turn the vehicle around it's it's hitting me on the other side we're just gonna have to deal with this um welcome it is thrifting therapy thursday if you are new here i do i go into the goodwill every thursday we just kind of look around um goodwill for me thrifting for me is is basically therapy so i love to come in here just once a week and kind of ease my mind look around um, look for something to resell i am a part-time reseller i'm an everything seller i literally sell everything if i can make some type of profit off of off of it i'm definitely going to pick it up so mainly i pick up my stuff from the bins um, because it is cheaper and also from salvation army but if there's um i like to pick up stuff for myself in the goodwills and also if it's something that's worth you know twenty dollars twenty five dollars or more usually i'll pick it up here if it's something that it's really different, unique. Also, I do a shout out on each one of my videos. And today's shout out, and I hope I say this right. I did listen to a lot of his videos, but I didn't catch him saying his name on any of the videos. Yeah, I want to say it's Isaiah Galarza. I will link him up here. If I said that wrong, I do apologize. I listened to as many as I could, hoping that you would um, say your name at least once so I can catch it. But on all the videos that I watched, I didn't catch the name. I work for the post office, so I'm in and out of my vehicle. Let's go check him out. Let's subscribe if we're not subscribed. Let's help him get to a thousand subscribers. Um, he does, if you like the Thrift With Me's, he does a lot of Thrift With Me's. He is also from Ohio. So he goes to different Goodwills around Ohio, which he is more on the north side. I'm kind of, I think, more in the middle. Go check him out. Let's show him some love. Let's try to help him get to 1,000 subscribers. And if you're ready, let's go inside. This is a smaller Goodwill in Powell, Ohio. So let's go check it out. So the crazy thing is the sun is out, but let me go around. I don't want to step on it in that. That seems kind of rude. So um, sun's out really strong but it's still a little chilly today. I'm telling you, Ohio's weather has been totally nuts. You wake up in the morning and you're not even sure what to put on. Half off color is green. Nice. They have a desk here. Looks like it's in decent shape. $5.99. That's not a bad price. This goodwill is really, really small, but it is in a, in a little bit of a ripsier town. Is that, um, oh, I don't want to break it. I wanted to see if that was home interior. Home interior sells really well. I have sold a couple pieces as a porch pickup and um, they do sell pretty fast especially if it's an older home interior looks like their purses are $6.29 oh that one's really cute what is that Jessica Simpson that's a huge bag. There we go. I always do that. It's pretty incline. Six twenty nine. I don't know what that is. What brand is that? some wallets. Okay. What did we oh green? <laughs> That's cute. I like that. I don't know what I would do with it though. It is so cute. Got backpacks here. T 
229 that's a good price don't see a brand on it though It's kind of in rough shape. It looks like they re rearranged some stuff since last time I was here. Woody. A bunch of beanie babies. I have a bunch of beanie babies. I had no luck selling at all. $3.99. Holy cow. $3.99. Might take this for my mother. She loves to crochet. Closet organizer. Oh, that is so neat. Two twenty nine. So we are gonna pull this up and see if this is worth anything. So the prices are kind of all over the place. Um, I seen fourteen dollars, and then I seen some for thirty dollars. Um. I'm not sure about this one. I'm probably not gonna get it because for $14, it's really not worth the hassle of shipping it out. So I'd have to find a box big enough for it or make a box big enough for it. Now rest for the fabulous. So this one actually resells for quite a bit, but it does not have the um, cord and I don't see where it plugs in. Maybe here, I'm not sure, maybe there. So I don't know if I want to take a risk on it since it does not have the microphone. I'm probably not going to risk it. are really pretty they're asking 422 a piece not bad at all it's super nice 
Oh my gosh, look at this teddy bear. He is so cute. $4.29. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Don't see a name on him though. jump over and look at some shoes so I'm definitely trying not to be in anyone's way These are pretty. Calvin Klein. I don't see a price on them. Oh, there it is. A four sixty nine. That's not bad. So at least this Goodwill here hasn't jacked up their prices on their shoes like a couple of the other ones I've been to have. Are funky, they're different. Maybe I can find some other jeans here. <laughs> I, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm gonna find them. Those are cute. I don't even know what they look like. I'm trying to see if I find any good jeans that are half off. Amazon Essentials. I didn't know they made jeans too. Goodness gracious, they made everything. Uh, oh, let's look at the jacket since nobody's shopping for jackets right now is the best time to get good jackets because nobody's really looking at jackets. So that's normally what I do is when I go into like Salvation Army because they have the dollar thing, I hit up all their jackets in the summertime and then I load up for winter. Because no one's 
really shopping for jackets anymore. So that's the best time to find the best jackets. I'm short. St. John's Bay, this one's brand new, $42, so it'd be $4. Detachable hood, doesn't have the hood. Torrid. What is this one, Columbia? This one's really pretty. So I'm looking for something to really, really jump out at me. For you, eight dollars. What size is that? Is that a men's medium? It is a medium. I'm gonna pause you guys for one second because I cannot see it. It was a women's medium. I'm looking for a men's medium. Of course, it's too tall for me now. It's way down here. Of course, I'm too short. Now I'm too old. Yeah, they definitely did rearrange a bunch of stuff. Um, there's people over there. I don't want to bother anyone. Let's see what we've got here. Ooh, these are interesting. What brand is that? These are nice. Half off shoes, size 8. They're not like in the best condition, but they'd be really good for work. Ooh, look at these are cool. What size are you? I love these. Oh, they're damaged. Four sixty-nine. I don't even see a size on them, but they're nice. They're definitely different. Ooh, look at these. I like those too. Jennifer Lopez. I don't like Jennifer Lopez. Those are cool. I don't know Jennifer Lopez, but... But I still don't like her. Oh, these have to be those, uh, are they? No. They look like those funky shoes. Um, what are they called? I can't think of what they're called. That's what they look like. What are those one funky shoes called? Darn it. Where are you? Oh, those are hookahs. Seven and a half. Yeah, those are in pretty bad shape. We've got a bunch of ties, or not a bunch of ties, but we've got some ties here. Oh, I smell someone's cologne. It smells really good. Robert here. Did I drop that? Yes, I did. Got some men's jackets right here.
Reebok. I'm telling you, I love this Goodwill. When my kids were little, I used to always stop here. I used to live in this little town, so on my way home from work, I would stop in here. Oh, that's very pretty. Four green tags. Columbia. That's really pretty. Four sixty nine, not bad, not bad. Prices are really good. I hope you guys can hear me since it's such a little goodwill. I'm trying my best not to be too loud so I don't come across rude. so I can go look. Hmm, these look so soft. They're so tiny though. Just fabulous. Those are interesting. They're a rough shape though. pretty worn. I try to get stuff my mom doesn't really have to clean up too much. Okay, we can look at some shirts. Now that there's no one in this aisle. That's really cute. Sheen, I see sheen everywhere. Which I mean they do. Their style of their clothing is nice, but their clothing is made so cheaply. That's really cute. It's not half off though, but it is adorable.
Amazon Essentials. So I want to go look at the men's shirts, but there's somebody over there right now, so I'm just waiting until they're done. That's cute. That one is half off. But I am going to the men's on Sunday, so. I'm going to the men's in Columbus. I usually go to the one in Marion, but I'm actually going to go to the one in Columbus Sunday. Go see what I can find. Okay, I think they left the men's department. Let me come back here. So they have men's and women's shoes here mixed in together. Oop, and I just dropped something. gonna price these they're only 469 so I'm gonna see what those go for and that's really the only thing that jumped out at me so we can look at some men's shirts my goodness they're really stuffed so I'm gonna set you guys down. If I find anything, I will show you guys. So I did find two Peter Millars. Um, they are in really good condition, but they're pink, so I'm not quite sure. This one's like a lavender color, but they're definitely a good color for um, spring. And they're only $4.99. I'm going to double check them, make sure there's nothing wrong with them. And I'm going to keep on looking. Like I said, I will show you guys anything I do decide to get. I'm almost done with the men's clothes. I guess you guys can stick around. Because I'm almost done with this side of the men's t-shirts. I do love that everything is the exact same price. No matter if it's a t-shirt or a polo. So this is an extra large, which is also a good size. Gonna give them a shot. Never know. Might get lucky. Might not. It'll be a lesson learned if I don't. But I know Peter Millar is a really good brand to pick up. More so in the dress shirts. But I'm gonna give these polos a shot and see if we have any luck selling these. If not, I know to never pick them up again. At least not the polos. Or the color. It could have something to do with the color. The colors, I wish they were different colors, but. Okay, so I'll be right back. So I found this really, really cool fireplace. Um, fall decor. I guess they have the books and stuff over here. They really don't have a whole lot of books or a lot of games. They have lots of movies though. That's brand new. I don't know what that is. Looks like their books are only a dollar nineteen. That is awesome. This is are definitely very, very good. Very good. What is this? Shopkins. Oh, this is old. Are there pieces missing? Oh, there they are. Probably lost some pieces though. Don't see any Monopoly games. Games are $1.99, which is great. don't see any Monopoly games at all. What is this? 
Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so we are taking the Pierre Millar. We're taking the Tommy Hilfiger snow boots. And what else did I find? I found a Carhartt long sleeve, $4.99. I got that for my son. Ooh. Half off. Oops, a Vineyard Vines. Half off. Definitely taking that. This is really cute. It does need a little bit of love, but it is so cute. So we are taking that. I love fall. And that's it. We're going to go ahead and roll out of here and pay. And we are going to the bends on Sunday. So if you want to see that, like and subscribe. And don't forget to follow our YouTuber of the day. And tomorrow I'm doing the second part of the Ben's haul, which will be my haul last night, which I have that uploaded. If you want to watch it last night, I did mom's haul and she did really good. She ended up with, I think a total resale profit of $628, I think. It was really good. So definitely check that out. And then I'm going to do my haul and upload that one on probably on Friday. So once again, let me show you guys this tiny, tiny little Goodwill. So it is super, super small, but they have a lot of real good stuff and their prices are really, really awesome. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.